Fox 11 on your Tuesday. Here's the latest with your forecast today. A live look at the current conditions this morning. A cloudy start in Waco from our Baylor Scott and White Health Sky Live weather camera. I think the clouds will be with us throughout the day. Very similar to where we were yesterday with the cloud cover early on. Breaks with some peaks of sunshine into the afternoon. But it's a very warm start. We're going to be in the 60s this morning, and I expect us to get into the low 80s for official highs this afternoon. Our average high is 74, and we're going to be above that number again for today, just like we were yesterday. Here's the latest with the satellite imagery mostly cloudy all across the area. I do see a few breaks within the clouds though on the satellite imagery this morning and some thinning within the clouds. So I do expect to get some of that sunshine to try and mix through. But we are looking at a lot of cloud cover just like we had yesterday. Not that full on sunshine like we were able to get over the weekend. But I do have sunshine on the way in your seven day and I'll show you more on that in just a moment. Currently 67 in Cameron this morning, 64 in Temple. Gatesville close to 70 for you at 68 degrees, 69 in Lampasas. Fort Hood currently at 66 degrees. No wind gusts on the map in Fort Hood at this moment, and then also no wind gusts in Temple. But you can see some gusty conditions setting up in Gatesville and Hamilton right now, ranging from 17 to 21 miles per hour with those wind gusts. And I think the wind gust chances are going to be with us throughout the day, ranging anywhere from 15 to 25 miles per hour into the afternoon and evening. This is by 6 o'clock today, and you can see we got a wind gust of 23 miles per hour in Meridian and 22 miles per hour in Waco. I do think the winds could get gusty within some of the thunderstorm possibilities that enter the forecast, especially for tomorrow. Gusty winds. Maybe a wind gust over 40 miles per hour will be possible within some of those storms for tomorrow. So it is something we're going to have to watch out for. Planning things out hour by hour. Noon temperature of 74, 79 by 3 o'clock, 5 o'clock temperature of 81, and then 73 by 8 o'clock tonight. Here's the latest with future track. It keeps the clouds, but also mixes in some clearing. So I think we'll get that again. Mix of sun and clouds in the forecast, but with the daytime heating, some pop-up shower and thunderstorm chances in our far western counties. Those will be heat driven. So once the sun goes down, those storms will die out. We've We've got more storm chances though in the forecast tomorrow. Spotty showers maybe tomorrow morning and then into the afternoon some showers and thunderstorms racing through the area for your Wednesday. Again, some of those storms showing some intensity. Maybe the possibility for some gusty damaging winds and large hail with these storms. It is spring. We've got a lot of moisture in place so we have to be on alert for this as we make our way into your Wednesday. There could be a few strong thunderstorms to watch out for. Of course, we'll keep you updated from the KCNHD Weather Center. There's a look at your Easter forecast. It is going to be cooler with highs in the upper 60s, but we're also looking at another chance for some showers and thunderstorms before we get to Easter. We got a big warm up 85 degrees by Thursday. That's the latest here. Jane and Chris back to you.